facility we manufacture strictly headliners and molded carpet. Uh, for the headliners we also manufacture our own substrate board which is a laminate process with uh, fiberglass. These are strictly used for automotive. We have a very close tolerance. We are plus minus um, usually about one millimeter, two millimeters max on a trim line. We are cutting strictly with uh, water jet, high pressure water jet cutting here. So the water jet is the most accurate way. All of our robots are six axis robots and uh, we even have the trim lines. On, on our headliner parts in specific, the cut line will be anywhere from 90 degrees to the surface to 35 degrees in some angles. The water jet cutting aspect will be running for uh, 15 hours a day. On the day shift, we will have 20 heads running, straight water, um, no, no abrasives, no additives. We, we have our, our balancer system is set up at uh, 54,000 PSI. We switch to the KMT cutting system that we currently have in place. We reduce the amount of floor space that we are taking up with intense fires by probably 60%. We used to have three mezzanines with intense fires on them. We now have one, which houses all of our intensifiers for the complete plant. Um, and we currently have capacity to run 32 hits. And uh, that has been a, a big change for us, um, even on the visual side of that, because one of the largest intensifier mezzanines was in the center of the plant. So you walked out onto the plant and you saw this massive mezzanine with these machines on top, that is gone. So that, that really opened up our plant visually. We start our intensifiers based on the number of heads we're gonna be running for the shift. And you have one machine to start, two machines to start, or in this case, three machines to start. We have two of the 100 horsepower with the, the redundant head for backup, and then we have one of the 200 horse with the redundant head. Seen very little downtime with our system. We have a, a daily inspection PM. It's a 30 minute inspection, but it goes a long ways towards keeping our system reliable and minimizing our time. The majority of the workforce, the maintenance staff that operate these, that start them up, that shut them off, they caught on to it very quickly. And we have in place with the, the KMT on off valves, uh, has really reduced our downtime drastically. Uh, one thing we have done here is also programmed all of our water jets to count the cycles on the valve. And we have been able to, in most cases, exceed our target of 250,000 cycles on a valve. It's very rare that we have a failure. And that is largely, I think, due to the the way we set up the system with the high pressure filters and with the diamond cutting arms. The goal of our company is to provide the best quality part we can to our customers. And we meet that quality by using good equipment.